Hi everyone. So today I am here for you. As you all know that your official answer key is released, and where you can check it, you can check it on the NTA website. Right there, you will see provisional answer key for NEET 2025. Right. So Shreya sir has already told you in detail right about this provisional answer key. Now, wait a minute. Yes. So uh, if you remember. Right, I told you about one question in your chemistry paper of NEET 2025. That was this question. In different different booklets, in different different bo uh, booklets, there will be different different question number that you will have. And here my booklet is 48. Right. So here this is the 51st question where you know that third and fourth were the correct answers here. Right. So now. In NTA provisional answer key, if you will see, this is fifty-one question. This is fifty-one, so it is given to us three and four. So depending upon different different uh, booklets and uh, A, B, C, D will be different there, right? Depending upon that, your answers will be one, two, three, four. In almost every answer, every uh, booklet answer, you will see that different. There is one question which is having two answers, right? So this is this question only that I am talking about. Now this thing is clear to us that NTA has given this question answer is two answers NTA has given you right now uh, those students students are asking them what if I have ticked one or what if what let's say this is the question okay what if you have ticked one what if you have ticked two right then negative marking will be there right if you have ticked three then you will get plus four marks. If you have ticked four, also you will get plus four marks, right? So third or fourth, if you have ticked, you will definitely get four plus four marks. But uh, one uh, thing that is there, there are students who assumed in the class that, ma'am, uh, it is having three and four, both the options. So I am very skeptical about this answer. So I'll have to skip this, right? Those who were scared of negative marking, they have skipped this question. Now, will they get any marks or no? Right, that is the main question here. So, according to right, if you if you have any two answers for one question, right? So that means the mistake is. How long you were getting no voice, ma'am? Audio issue. For how long you were getting no voice, beta? Right. Okay. So I'll just again repeat it. So guys, this is the question, right? That is in booklet forty-eight, right? I have booklet forty-eight, right? Depending upon your textbook, right? You will have different, different like uh, uh, question number of this question here, right? Now to see the answer here, the answer will be third or fourth. Right, both of them are the correct answers here. Right now, NTA has given. You will see this is forty-eight booklet. I'll see this is the forty-eight booklet. This is question number fifty-one. That is three and four. This is uh, question number fifty-one. That is three and four. So means two questions are the correct answer. Right. So now, one question that ma'am, what if I have uh, ticked one as the correct answer? Then they will deduct one marks there. Right. That will be negative marking. If you have ticked second as the correct option, one marks will be deducted here because both of them are not the correct answers. Now, if you have ticked any of third or fourth, right, you will get full marks. If you have ticked third and fourth both, even then you will get full marks. Now, the problem is with those students who have not ticked anything; they have skipped this question because 
you know when you have two answers to a question which is not in the rules right of the uh, this nt and this neat competitive exam so according to the uh, according to the rules and regulations this should be skipped here this question they should drop here reason being one question it's not a multiple answer question right so you you can only have one answer to one question right so that is the mistake on the nta side right that's not your mistake so what i believe that all the students right who have skipped this question right thinking that ma'am this is also right this is also right so i'm very skeptical about it i'll just skip this question right they were also correct right because they were skeptical both answers cannot be correct this is not j that you can have multiple answers here right so that's why this question should be dropped by nta that is according to me right because that will be a fair decision for the neat aspirants because in neat every single marks matters the most right even if some student who has ticked let's say 3 or 4 and some student who knew that the answer can be 3 or 4 but they just played very safe right they didn't take anything for those students they are losing plus 4 marks right and plus 4 marks matters a lot in neat exam right uh, you can have like uh, you can in plus 4 marks you can get the college or you can not get the college right it's as simple as that plus 1 marks also matters the most so just think about plus 4 marks right so that's why what i feel nta should uh, drop this question and i would write i would like to know from your side as well what you think about this question should it be dropped or uh, the students who have ticked third or fourth or any of them they should be provided with the marks let us see in the comment section also i would love to know like what you actually demand and uh, i also want to know that for this question how many of you have ticked 1 2 3 or 4 and how many of you skipped it thinking that uh, this can be this is a wrong question and this should be dropped okay i want to know that in the comment section guys okay yes uh, don't worry that will be soon out okay that will be soon out okay then students and uh, right now i know that you need counseling right your uh, provisional answer key is out and you are right now in that zone that you know your marks right where should i get admission what are the opportunities that i have ma'am in india what are the opportunities abroad what are the opportunities right okay in um, less fees what colleges i can opt for right all these things are going in your head right now so students just let me know in the comment section if you want us to give counseling to you right if you want the counseling from our team right from our team vidantu's team then definitely will be here but for that i want to know in the comment section how many of you want that from us right okay yes okay then students uh, i would love to know that what you actually want this question to be dropped or give marks to uh, the students who have got given answer three or four or both of them as correct right that's it and all the best students i really hope so you are happy with your results and i would love to know your results also in the comment section if you are comfortable with that that's it students bye bye take care and also if any counseling anything is needed talk to us on our telegram channel talk to us on the comment section as well so that we can help you in any way possible right that's it bye bye